the last time we were here, we were sold Mobile One synthetic oil. But we went and we had it tested at a lab, mm -hmm. and we didn't get Mobile One synthetic. Can we talk to you about that? We put oil chain shops across Central Texas to the test and found you are not always getting what you pay for. Our hidden camera investigation last month revealed some shops making a secret switch and overcharging you for the oil they're putting in your car. Now our Brian Collister goes undercover again and finds those shops making big changes since our story first aired. Uh, that was the main game, sell, sell, sell. Rashad Luster says managers at this True Balance Express in Round Rock pushed him and other mechanics to sell high dollar synthetic oil. But he says something didn't seem right with the oil they put into customers' cars. My suspicion was when one of my upper ups kept telling me he wouldn't put that in his car. And I was like, well, why wouldn't he put that in his car, but we're putting it in everybody else's? Luster says managers told him it was a blend, part synthetic, part regular oil. How can you put the same cheap oil in a synthetic engine and it run the same? And then that's how I figured it out. And then when I saw the test on TV, I was like, oh yeah. What he saw on TV was our KXAN investigation confirming his suspicions with True Balance, where he no longer works, saying he left because he didn't like the service customers got. It's a ripoff. Another former employee says he quit his job after taking this picture, which he says shows a mechanic filling a jug labeled synthetic with cheaper conventional oil. Trying to tell them they're selling Don Perignon and they're handing them a Miller Lite with Don Perignon sticker on it. We went undercover at all four of this chain's locations and sent the samples to Alcor Petro's lab. The blue line shows what high dollar synthetic mobile one looks like. Not even close to the red line showing the oil we got. Hi, are you Brandon? How are you? How you doing? Good. Brian Collister with KXN. Something True Balance's owner denied uh, knowing. In each and every case where a customer asks for synthetic and you give them the cheap oil, you pocket a lot of profit. I, I don't understand. I, this has come out of nowhere. I haven't, haven't got no customer complaint from nobody. Well, how is a customer supposed to be able to tell when you don't give them synthetic oil? We had to pay hundreds of dollars to get lab tests done to prove it. Maybe that's the reason you do it, because nobody can tell. That's, I, I don't, I have no other comment. We recently went undercover again to True Balance in Round Rock and the chain's West Slaughter location. Now things are very different. The employee who gave us conventional oil last time went out of his way this time to show us we'd get what we paid for this visit. That's what you'll be receiving. That sounds great. All right. We also went back undercover to Lakeway Quick Loop, where weeks earlier, this was the response we got after testing the oil they put in our car. It appears that, that you, we bought something, but you didn't give it to us. You gave us the, uh, the conventional oil. But this time... Do y'all have any of the, um, the synthetics? Yeah. Mobile One? Yeah. Lakeway Quick Loop explained the oil we'd be getting before putting it in. We only use bottles, synthetic oil here, so there isn't more of an upcharge than maybe down in Austin B. It's uh, 89, I believe, for your car. Oh, okay. We sent these three new samples of oil to the lab, and the tests prove this time the shops gave us the high grade, high dollar synthetic oil we paid for. Since testing oil is expensive, there's an easier way to make sure you get what you pay for. Buy your own oil, bring it to an oil chain shop, they'll just charge you the labor to put it in. Brian Collister, KXAN Investigates.